Nigeria would have to invest in infrastructure, innovation and skilled labor for economic growth and integration into the global marketplace. This is the position of the former Minister of Industry, Trade and Investments, Olusekun Akanga, when setting agenda for the manufacturing sector in Nigeria to remain competitive in the intra-Africa trade area. He was speaking at an event in Lagos focused at setting the agenda for competitive manufacturing under the AFC, FTA and what Nigeria needs to do. We seek your intervention to facilitate an engagement between Central Bank and MAN to discuss the recent lifting of the restriction on access to foreign exchange or for the three items. Your Excellency, we are confident that the outcomes of conversation will allow the CBA to achieve its objective of reducing pressure on the parallel market and effective control of the foreign exchange administration. At the same time, it will ensure that the domestic production is stored overall by influx and imported alternative and our raw materials that are locally available could be procured using the official market. Continuity is key. Continuity is our major problem. Not plans. When I was in government, I saw many, many plans. Go through each ministry, there are plans there, so many plans. And I ended up saying, I was always saying, that we are long, I use the word expression of a Haitian manager, I say, we are long on plans, and very short on implementation. China, Germany, and the United Kingdom and others are on their fourth industrial revolution plan. And unlike Nigeria, South Africa has an automotive policy that it reviews, enhances periodically, and that it has implemented rigorously for more than 60 years a policy for more than 60 years. The former minister also harped on the need to create a macroeconomic framework that would further boost economic growth. The need to design a macroeconomic framework that will be supervised by a strong macroeconomic management team that is accountable to the president. The CBN cannot do it alone. If there's any message, go and look at the causes of inflation, the causes of the exchange rate. I look at the causes before you start talking about symptoms. When you look at the causes, you will find out that CBN alone cannot address this problem. You need a team of the economic ministries to work together.